hey what's up guys how's it going welcome back to another video and if you're new to this channel kindly smash on the subscribe button and turn on the bell icon so anytime i upload a new video you guys will be notified so literally you might have been thinking like why do fiverr remove the buyer request option because actually uh, some buyers or some clients or some sellers have actually relied on this and most sellers or they come through by a request and what could be the reason why Fiverr remove it and turn it to another way around <clears throat> there are different kind of reasons they might have looked into to the reason why they remove it and turn it to the fact that once um, a buyer posts a job then they'll be the one to um, scout out the, the job to the right uh, seller and the issue I've been going around and people have been asking like what could have been the reason to why Fiverr removed the buyer request option and turn it to another way around which most people literally don't understand how it works and how they can go about it and that's reduced some sellers orders drastically because that is how they used to apply for jobs on a daily basis some people make use of the 10 option where they will be able to get at least one or two orders after sending like 10 uh, proposal on a daily basis and um, so now they are unable to send any proposal again. so what could be their fate and what they will be doing right now and how would they maintain uh, the platform and also be saying order since what they believe in is not there again so I check on the Fiverr community to see what's actually going on there so this is what I found so let's try to go through it so we can see what people are actually saying about the buyer request that are being removed permanently on Fiverr so this guy posted like buyer request permanently removed on the last up update of Fiverr says the buyer request model has been has been off so seller like me who had 80 percent order from buyer request left to no choice so which means this particular guy is getting orders through only buyer request so now as fiber have removed uh the buyer request option so his chance of getting order again very slim and you will spend a lot of times on uh on online on fiverr without getting order so my advice for this a guy like this is just for him to optimize his gig and make sure people are able to find his gig through the search that's the only way around he can be able to maintain and still be getting order on fiverr so another one from it's probably for the top rated sellers so and what i actually think is that i'm not sure if they remove the buy request from top rated seller but then I literally don't know for now. I can't actually say what's actually going on. So this one say it's happened in non-level sellers. And like I I can also sh tell you for the fact that when I check one of my level one um my level one fiverr account, I can say that uh there are some uh buyer requests on the op uh, options and I was able to see offer in there. So Probably it was removed for the sake of um, new sellers. Then they will be able to roll out to some jobs for them in the future. So anytime they set any seller that set up their brief, then they should be able to uh, get a brief regarding any project. So another one says that then what should we do? Like how new seller will survive? So you can see there are different kind of feelings that people are actually getting from this and then um, i can actually say because most people have already depend on this even me myself i used to post on buyer requests anytime i need someone to execute a project for me so now it will be even very hard for to, for me to see a buyer that can work within my my budget so i'll have to be chatting different sellers until I was able to find a competent one who can actually who can actually do the job for me. So this one also said that 
though the buyer request has not been removed permanently you can find the buyer you can find the request on pc not on full app so i'm not sure if this one have uh checked on uh pc to know what's up or probably is uh, a level two seller updated so this one also says that buyer requests are now not available on desktop pc so different things different feelings from different people yeah i get my first sale using buyer request i think it will be a little difficult to get the first sale but finding a seller from the buyer side will be really easy so 200 plus without checking buyer request you know sometimes buyer get 200 percent uh 200 plus template buyer request sometimes first time buyer will be referred to experienced sellers but if you can seo or uh, your gig and create a professional profile i think it will definitely be easier to get sale or the best so like i said earlier on if this if you rely on buyer requests and this happened to you already so the next thing for you to is just to optimize your gig just optimize your gig so once you do that then you just it will take time i, I can understand to take time but then you'll be able to cover as fast as possible that you just looking at to see maybe fiverr will bring back buyer request of course not they're not going to bring it back so it's gone and it's gone it cannot come back again or else you make use of the uh brief which is the new updates regarding um if you really want to see an offer through the buyer request options so another one is buyer request permanently removed buyer request <laughs> so different kind of things and i also check through also check through cora to see what we're actually saying about this and also it's all different as well not totally removed buyer request but partially you can uh see the most suitable request probably this one is actually a a level two or level one seller but then he's also trying to promote his gig because this is his gig link and once you click on it you'll be able to say that he's promoting his own gig and that one says that they must have felt they were not being utilized enough or that they were too there were too many spam because individual brief for jobs have been uh, introduced to replace them and are sent to sellers who they feel the job is suited to. So this is actually the deal. Yes. So there is a lot of spam in buyer requests. Like uh, it's very low. There are some people that will feel like when you want to work for them, probably if you are in writing, you have experienced this. Some people will message you that they want they post a request that they want one thousand word article and their budget is five dollars. Of course, there will be some sellers that will apply for the job, but I think that price sounds so little and very small to what they actually need. And they will also explain that the things should be, the, the, the word count should be unique and all. So, how do you expect someone to sit down and write 1,000 word blog post for just $5? And at the end, Fiverr will also subcharge 20% of it, and the seller will only have four dollars at the end so the price is actually low. you can actually tell that the price is very low so this is uh one of the reasons maybe one of the reasons why they remove the the stuff so another one is this it's nothing but about competitive proposal writing and uh having a few review remember clients are less likely to consider a new seller just like we wouldn't uh uh, electrician who is unknown so as for proposal writing keep learning about it on youtube and course website don't forget to up to upvote uh, if this help so and what i also learned about this is that there are some people there are some sellers who have a template that they will just go ahead and paste template without even reading what the buyer want they just copy and paste template imagine copy and paste template that doesn't even resonate to what you need so some by some clients some sellers are actually i don't know what to say i don't know what to say and you see different kind of if you post a request often you have understand what i'm trying to say but they will not even read what you posted imagine you want to hire someone to do 
YouTube SEO for you, then the person is trying to tell you that he can sell you, he can sell watch hour, watch count, and views for you. Meanwhile, it's not even related to what you actually need. So all that is not uh, probably a part for uh, of why buyer uh, Fiverr actually removed the buyer request, and I'm not sure if they can actually bring it back again. It's gone and gone forever. And if you can make use of this new method, which is the uh, the brief by setting up a brief, I think you should be able to scale out and be able to get order on Fiverr as fast as possible. And don't forget to also optimize your gig. You really need to optimize your gig so that buyer can be able to find your gig in the search bar and then you have to get message impressed on clicks and make sales through your Fiverr account. So these are for you in this video. And I hope this helps you and hope you understand what you should be expecting and so far you already know that it's the Fiverr buyer request has been permanently removed so you just have to move on and start the new way to promote your service and be able to make sales on Fiverr so thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe to this channel and like this video as well I will see you in the next one peace